before this video gets too far ahead, I just want to let you guys know I do have a link in the description below where you guys can actually buy plush that I've won from arcade games and a bunch of other places from claw machines and everything else. They also come with an autograph card, so go down, check out the link description below. What is poppin' y'all? Hope you're doing great, doing fantastic, all that good stuff. So we are here at the club this morning. We got a meeting here uh, with the landlord. He's coming through about the ice maker thing. He's gonna walk us in the back room back there because that door's locked because it goes with the upstairs, downstairs, side, side, whatever you wanna call it. And uh, yeah, if you guys did not see the video, we're thinking about moving the refrigerator to here. These cupboards will be moved, ripped out or whatever. And then the ice maker will be where the fridge is. The fridge will be here. These will get moved over here. This will get moved um, in Neverland, I guess. I don't know. We'll see what happens. So all in all, though, um, we do got... Did I set it down back there? I think I did set it down back here as I was talking. Uh, where did it go? I don't know where it went. But uh, da, 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 da. Oh, it's right here. We got the ore. Heck to the yes for this wall right here. So this wall will be complete after I do this right here. Boom. Heck to the yes. Look at that. Boom. We got that, that, that. Heck to the yeah. Everything is coming together. Also got some more new stuff, so I'll show you guys so that. So we now. end up getting this right here. It's like a little, uh, I don't know what the heck you want to call it, but um, we're gonna put ice in it. And then we got some squeeze bottles. I don't know if the squeeze bottles are over here or not. Uh, I don't think so, but we got squeeze bottles. They're gonna have the syrups and stuff in them. We're gonna stick those in there. We're gonna probably build something back here somewhere to kind of sit it up. Um, so yeah, also, She's carrying in something really cool that we're going to be doing. Never been done before. Dun, 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 dun. An ice cream maker. So we're going to be making protein ice cream. That is something we have never seen done in the nutrition clubs. So now the video, I put it in the video. Probably 475,000 people. We're like, oh, look at that ideal. That ideal is so great. And then you have another 475,000 people say, that's a stupid ideal, blah, 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 blah. Same thing as this, blah, 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 this, or this, or this, or this. All in all, though, yeah, I think it's going to be a cool idea, especially in the town we're in. Um, have like an ice cream special of the week, ice cream uh, special for this or that. Basically, you can get your shake as ice cream, a bowl, um, a waffle, or just a normal shake. I think I didn't say that one, but yeah, my hair is a little wild today. This right here is the squeeze bottles I was trying to tell you guys about. So the little squeeze bottles here. They'll have like the jellies and stuff in them and then it'll just sit inside there like so with ice and stuff so they stay we we're going to do the mini fridge ideal where we're going to try to put the mini fridge right there but it did not fit correctly and we can't put it in these because it doesn't have ventilation and stuff so yeah we don't know where we're going to be putting that at maybe in my office but maybe not maybe in her office maybe back there maybe over there we don't know yet but once we get that figured out we'll let you know um but yeah this right here we don't know exactly where we're going to be putting this at. Also, I think we're going to be moving these down a little bit, each one. And then we're going to probably put another one of these racks potentially here um, or somewhere in this area over here um, so we can get more flavoring because we're going to be getting a total of probably like, um, be like 20 can fit on there plus another 25, 30, 35, but 35 flavors out of the 43. As of right now. So yeah, also Loop it hooked us up with a, um, is that the note right there? Where at? Oh, okay. Well, I guess we'll run over to the post office see if we can grab our package. Um, but we were talking about putting these TVs across up here. Um, the Loop devices are what's actually gonna go in there. Um, same as this over here, this right here. You can um, customize them and everything like that. Um, I'm like, I'm looking at it. It's like package. Blah, 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 blah. I don't know. I mean, it says available. For, I mean, we'll walk over and see. But, um, but yeah, basically, we're going to run the loops into the TVs up there. It's going to save us a lot of money because the one company, they wanted $50 per device. That would have been 150 bucks for three of them. On top of that, it would have been another um, $50 per device a month. So it costed us. 150 up front and then another 150 every month just to run the TVs, which their service was cool. It, it, it was, you know, it worked great. But with these devices, I'm gonna have to use a little bit more effort, but we're still able to 
I'm gonna have to do a little more effort to create the stuff and whatnot, but once it's created, I'll be able to just put it on the screen and stuff like that remotely from my office or anywhere in the world, technically. So say, you know, this is actually really cool. We're on vacation, we're out and about, got some employees, they don't know how to do the TV switch or whatever. We just spend five seconds, get on the freaking phone, you know, in Cuba, uh, freaking Africa, Iraq, Iran, freaking, name a, name a random place, Paris, yeah. freaking anywhere in the world we are. It doesn't matter where we are. As long as we have internet service, North Korea, we got internet, we can just go on the freaking, freaking thing. It's a freaking thinking thing. I can't think. We get on the freaking thing, freaking thinking thing, and we can just change it. Boom. There it is. So, heck to the yes. That's what I like about it, the conveniency of that. And it's free, and they pay us, actually, to have it. So, they pay us, and we get to have it. So, it's going to be pretty cool. And we can also play music videos and all that other stuff. So, if we want to do later on, like you were talking about before, wanting to do classes and stuff, if we ever wanted to, we could then change, like, two of the TV screens to, like, like, or one of the TV screens to like a camera or something like that. So people could be like seeing this or they could, or you could change it to um, music video or something like that. Or, you know, with the songs on it. I don't know. So many options. So many, so many, this like endless options we could do with it. So heck to the yes. But we're going to walk over to the post office, see if they have our package or not. You know, one of the best things about being right here, the post office is right there. <laughs> so we literally just have to walk right across the street to go get it. Well, that's if they have it across the street. If they don't have it, then we're going to find out real quick. All right, y'all. So we went over there. We got the package. Heck to the yes. So the guy over at the post office is like, uh, I don't think that's, I don't think we'll have it here. But luckily, they did. Heck to the yes. So open this thing up. Pretty big size box. So it should be a few of them in here, actually. Um, should be at least three. So boom. Loop number one. Loop number two. And over here we got some stickers and stuff. And then loop number three. Heck to the S. Looks like these are a little, a little bit used and used, but we'll open up and see. Some stickers and stuff in there. But heck to the yeah, yeah. Let's open this up. Let's see. Looks all nice. Heck yeah. Looking brand new for the most part. That's what we want, that's what we want. Heck yeah, the packaging of these things is always so nice. But we got three of them, three of these loop devices. So like I said, these right here will be for the menus up top and advertising and stuff up there, which I'm so excited about. Heck to these. Anyways though, today's another big day. We're trying to finalize everything to get all of the floor plans and blueprints and all that stuff like that submitted. That was a big $200 that is gonna be going out. Um, everything seems big anymore. Like five bucks seems big to us right now. But every little dime we've been making has been going straight back into this. So everyone has helped us send us anything. You guys are absolutely amazing. It's definitely, definitely, definitely helped us get farther and along this journey um, and let our dreams come true. Um, like I said, big thing. Um, we just need to keep trucking, keep pushing, keep motivated and just keep on keeping on with this whole process because the moment we give up, the moment we stop, is the moment that we lose and we're not losing. We're gonna win, we're gonna get those doors open. People are gonna be coming to that door sooner than later and we're gonna have this place open. I'm so freaking excited to get this crap out of the windows and just have people look in and see what the heck's going on, come in, experience this all. I'm just so pumped for that. It's been such a, I don't even know. It's been such a stressful and just wild road but we're so excited just to get the doors open, get going and everything like that. And just this little, like little things, like just this ore finally being on the wall, it just makes me like, wow. Like, you know what I mean? I don't know, just little things like that. It's like, it just looks finished. It looks finished. I'm just so pumped to get these TVs up on the freaking ceiling. That's gonna be another level, next freaking level right there. Um, that's literally what we gotta do. Some of this little stuff here. So this like is there. literally what we need to fill in. Some of these little gaps here. We need to get some of the glue off of all these, kind of uh, grind them down a little bit, make them so they're not so sharp. Uh, get all the glue off. We gotta get that done. And then over in here, get this wood. We still gotta put one more thing up, one more row up over here in the bathroom, right up over there. So we gotta get that figured out. I don't know what the hell they're doing with this. They're supposed to bring us a new one, but it's still like that. 
So I don't know. We still don't have our trash can from Citas, Centos, whatever you want to say. Um, so once we get that, whatever the hell they're going to do with this thing um, done, we get all this stuff sanded up and all the glue off of it and make it so it's not so sharp. Some spots like right there, some glue. We're going to be rocking and freaking rolling. There's literally so many little details. It's all like this, like hurry up and wait now for the most part. Once we submit this, it's going to be hurry up and freaking wait. Ooh. I was like, that looks like a good amount of money. I'm doing some door dashing as well. But somebody wants us to go uh, 17.5 miles for $19.30. Doesn't seem like the greatest order. 83 items. No, so you. a little bit more of a recap of this ice cream stuff I was telling you guys about a minute ago. Um, yeah, we got this ice cream maker. We got a crazy... Bob, what are you doing, buddy? Bob's over there on the ground cleaning. But we got this ice cream maker. It makes four quarts of ice cream, which is freaking amazing. Um, what we're going to be doing with it probably is making ice cream eventually and, uh, you know, serving it and stuff like that once we get the licensing and stuff to be able to do so. Um, but like I said before, we're getting all the paperwork filled out up front up there, which I think Christina is officially done with filling out all the paperwork, which is awesome. So now all we're waiting for is... Um, the landlord's coming today. We're gonna go, like I said, in the back room back there and see everything and uh, figure all that out. And then after we get done with that, we're leaving and we're actually gonna head downtown and drop off the plan uh, thing, whatever you wanna call it, that big blueprint thing. So they can hopefully approve everything, say good to go and get that ball freaking rolling, baby. So let's all go. All right, y'all, so we got this hung up on the wall, on the photo wall over here, it says Lake air pointing towards the lake which is freaking awesome so when you come up to the photo wall you can get your photo on hold your drink up all that good stuff that as a background so you just don't got a plain green wall i wish it was a little bit bigger but it'll do thanks to the yes i'm excited to rip all this crap off the windows here very soon hopefully um bring that natural light in here that'd be pretty cool but all in all though we're waiting still Still waiting, still waiting, still waiting. The landlord said he got caught up on some stuff or, or got caught up in some meetings or something like that. So we're still waiting. Christina got the sink all cleaned up, good to go. Back to the yeah, yeah. Um, But yeah, all in all though, we're just gonna wait, 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 and wait some more, I guess. But also we got this hung up, some stuff in my office, heck to the yes. Got my little play button right there. Got this going on. Got my Mike Tyson autograph picture over here from the punch out game. Got my Pac-Man thing up over there, this wall. Got where I've, everywhere I've been. Anywhere that's gold, uh, I haven't been to that state yet. But everywhere else that's not gold and it's like a color, I've been there. Uh, I'm waiting for something to go right here. I got something in my, my house that I'm actually hanging up probably right around in here. Um, what else we got hung up? I put some stuff up there. Shout out to Mateo for giving me that. Got my Mr. Beast car and then I got my little ghost light up there as well. So the office is finally coming together. Still a little bit of a mess going on over here, but it's coming together, coming together, coming together, coming together. Bob's out here still running around trying to find his damn house. Um, I don't know if he's gonna get close, but his house is over in this corner over, over there. But he's all running around up here and everywhere else but where he needs to go. So, Bob, go to your house. <laughs> he's running out of battery too, so he's been running around for a couple hours now. But he needs to uh, scoot, 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 scoot over to his house. But one thing I've learned about them is they normally have to do like a couple different laps and go all around the place. Like, I don't know, give it a week or so. And then they know like, like literally the floor plan of your house, which is kind of creepy. But yeah, so he'll probably eventually make his way there or he'll die trying. All right, y'all. So the landlord just came through and he let us know that where we're gonna put the ice maker is kind of a little weird and didn't really make the most sense. It made sense but to run all the lines and all the work, it's gonna be a pain in the butt. So he was cool. And he said, what about right here in front of the door? We said, we didn't know if you wanted to block the door, but he's all down for it. So heck to the yes there, it's gonna go right there. And uh, all the plumbing, all the stuff's literally right there, ready just to hook it up, run it right through there and be good to go. So this will probably be where everything gets plugged into. Ran, there's power here, um, everything's right there. So. That's probably where it's going to go. So everything here will stay. And this is probably where the ice maker is going to go. Right here. The only thing we might have to figure out is 
something with this. We might have to move it to like here or something, which is fine. Which is fine because if with the ice maker, they won't be able to get to it as much. It will come out a little ways, it'll stick out, but I don't think it'll be a big problem because this is pretty much already sticking out a little ways. So it'll be, it'll be cool. All in all though, we're going to uh, go submit this freaking paperwork now. So, all right y'all, it's that time. We're going into the health department stuff to get this stuff filed. Well, <laughs> we got the plan, we got the plan stuff still with us. I'll explain what we need to do or what we need to add we or have something. To go back and Add a few pieces of information. Yeah, we gotta find out. They, they wanna know where our dumpsters are and stuff like that. So we told them where they were, but they were like, oh, you have to write them on the paper. And then they said something about the fridge, potentially, maybe that. So, um, what else did they say? The, the ceiling. That was a weird one. I was like, what? I don't understand that. The ceiling thing confuses me. So, what did we have to do with the ceiling she was saying, though? Um, apparently, have to get different tiles. So you can like no, technically like wipe them no, down or something. So you know how the how the tiles that are in there kind of mm -hmm. like ours aren't porous like they they well they're porous they yeah. don't have the holes in them. Yeah. But they're not like vinyl coated, pretty much. So remember me telling you every surface has to be wipeable, moppable. Yeah. Crazy. I don't. I guess just in case you, <laughs> you explode can mop a, sh a shake and it goes all the way up to the ceiling. I would just replace the whole freaking tile. Yeah, me too. But, <laughs> but I guess they have just, some different things. I didn't have to do that in. Yeah. In carry. But yeah, it can't be open. I don't know. It's so weird. It's so weird. It can't be open, but it can't be what we have. It can't be the. It's a lot of different things. So. It's okay. It's not. Don't let it overwhelm you. I know. Just, It'll be all right. We'll be all right. We're gonna go. We're gonna give information we need. We're gonna come back. Yep. Before That's the, the plan. Close. That's the plan. It's two seventeen. We got to be back by two thirty or two thirty. Four thirty. Four thirty. We're not making it. But all right, we're heading back over to the shop, get this stuff, and then head back up over here. All right, y'all. So moment of truth. We're heading back out. We took a piece of the tile out to see if it's okay or not. Um, see if it's going to be approvable or not. Um, we really hope so. So uh, we're going to head down that way now and find out. We also labeled everything else that they told us to label, and uh, go down and see if they find anything else they want us to label or whatnot and stuff so we'll let you know here we go round two are you ready yeah. go. <laughs> so our ceiling is okay the guy who was the guy that the health was, commissioner the main guy the big boss they said the big boss man was the one that looked at it and he said he was cool he was cool and i made sure to ask him all the important and we asked him all the important questions and he said everything looked good, everything was cool. And then the other lady, he said, let me confirm it with the boss lady and the other lady or whatever. Mm -hmm. He ran it by her. She said, everything's fine. So that is, it's like a stress relief over. Cause that was gonna be almost like a thousand dollars probably to replace that ceiling in there. Mm -hmm. And they said, everything's fine. So it was easy. Excited. We just brought a piece. We literally of brought a piece of the ceiling back we there a piece somewhere. Of the ceiling somewhere with us, so they could yeah. just look at it. Yep. Feel so. it. Make sure it was good. Yeah. So we're good there. We are good there. We're good there. I'm just like so you nervous. Were like instantly, completely stressed out. Yeah, because I was like, how are we going to come up with another thousand dollars that we don't have? So I was like, oh no. You know, it's like fixing a car. They say you always start with the simplest, cheapest solution first. Which was bring the pieces floor in, bring the ceiling. piece of ceiling in, and so they could feel it and look at it. And they fixed it that way. That was the problem fixer. So all in mm -hmm. all, though, man, I am starting to not like this building with all the stress. We got to come back down here in the you next couple to weeks. Get excited. Yeah, I was excited until I had to go in and do this, and I was not excited. I was until like, we're going like face to face with the people that tell you that literally yes, no. the people that are standing between you and your business opening the doors to your business. Yeah, it's nerve wracking for sure. I was just like, but they are just here to help us and make sure we're legal and doing everything the right way in the same yeah. way. So yeah, so I mean, I understand where they're coming from. It's just so stressful. If you guys have ever been through this, let me know in the comments down below. It is stressful so stressful but heading back over to the shop put our ceiling tile back in the ceiling yes. where it goes and uh yeah i don't know exactly what else we're getting into but we're heading back over there all right y'all so something crazy just happened i know christina's trying to get out of here she's annoyed with me a little bit at least i feel like are you annoyed with me 
supposed to leave an hour ago, so I can go home and work too. Yes, but guess what? Give me a fist bump for this one. Let me show you so guys. As you guys know, we have the TV here that does the music videos and everything like that. It does all that cool stuff, shows the logo, which I don't know why the logo is not there. I have to add it back, I guess, but it does all the stuff across the bottom, so on and things. Well, we end up upgrading. Not one, not two, not three, but we got four loop devices now. All four of those are gonna be hooked up to TVs. These three are gonna be hooked up to the menus up on top because we just messed around with it. Well, I was messing around with it. And it actually is really cool. We might end up getting a fifth, a fifth one, as crazy as that is. But we get paid 20, 20, 20, and 20 dollars, 20 bucks each for each one we run. So we literally get paid, babe, just to have these on. What do you think about that? We we're gonna have to pay $150 plus $150 a month for three of them. And we got all four of these for free, and they pay us 80 bucks right now just to run these. Is that insane or is that insane? No, thank you. But I'm thinking about to get the fifth one because we just messed with it. I didn't show you guys, but you can actually use a web browser. A web freaking browser. So we've been fighting with this thing, fighting with this thing, fighting with this one to try to get this thing to display what we want to display over here. So when people check in over there, it shows that right there. Well, we figured it out. You can actually add a website link, everything, and it automatically just boom, pops right in. So heck to the yes. I'm so excited about that. And the coolest thing about all of it, we don't have to go up there and unplug them and plug them, plug them, unplug them, mess with it, all that. We just go right over here. This is what I see. This right here, I see all this. And if I want to change anything or whatever, I just go through. I can change everything in here. If I want to change what the wording is, I can type whatever I want there. I can set the days, the times, everything that I want it to do. I can run images, video, websites, RSS, text. I can do all of that, which is absolutely mind blowing. So we have four of them over here now. And if you zoom over this way, you can see that these two bars right here are actually all the way full. That means we've got our 20 bucks from that device. If you go to the next device, as you can see, there's nothing there yet. So, um, and same with this one and the same with this one, they all have nothing except for the one right there and it's all the way filled up. So once the device gets all the way filled, that bar gets all the way filled up, they give you 20 bucks. Once you get it filled up, there's no like, let me fill it up again and again and again. It's once it's filled up, you get 20 bucks at the end of the month. So every time at the end of the month, you get 20 bucks. Last month, we got 20 bucks and we filled it up. So we've run it, but um, now that's how we're gonna get 80 bucks. And I don't know why more people ain't doing this. We've told a couple of clubs about it and they've kind of just was like, just brush it off their shoulder, didn't think nothing of it. But this thing is a game changer. Literally you can customize your menus, do this, do this, 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 and so much more that I haven't even talked about in here, which is exciting, it's so cool. So, heck to the yes, saves a lot of money. Saves so much time from having to get the ladder out, climb up and down, and uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm excited. I'm excited, excited, excited. But we're heading out of here. Are you excited? Yes. Let's go. All right, we've left the club. What are you doing over there? <laughs> I got me a couple Lunchables and I got some new cereals. I'm so excited, look at this. Look at all these cereals, I'm so excited. She's up there, she's hiding. <laughs> we got some uh, frozen meals because that's what we've been eating lately, honestly. We've been trying to eat as clean as possible, but I've been living on Lunchables and cereal and she's been living on little frozen meals. <laughs> We're gonna get out of here though. Nah. Good morning, y'all. It is the next day, and I just got up. Literally, I just got up not too long ago. We didn't have any of our cereal last night, which was, I mean, I think Christina had some of the, yeah, she tried these ones, these Fruity Pebbles, or Fruit, Pebbles, Fruit Loops with marshmallows. Let me know if you've ever had them. Fruit Loops with marshmallows. They're actually pretty good. They're almost like miniature size um, Fruity Pebbles, or I keep calling Fruity Pebbles, Fruit Loops. I didn't show you guys all of them. But she got some mini wheats. I don't like mini wheats. She's like, what other box do you want? I said, I don't really want any other box. So um, I got these ones though. Good old Lucky Charms. But I got it with the new little, uh, whatever you want to call it, gems or whatever. Um, never tried these yet. These uh, cinnamon toast graham cracker ones or whatever. Cinnagram toasted crunch or whatever you say. 
So I'm gonna try those ones. I'm super excited about that. And then these, these actually look so freaking good. And I kind of want to make them into Rice Krispie treats. Right here, cinnamon Rice Krispie, cinnamon, cinnamon sugar Rice Krispie treats. That would be insane. So yeah, looks like they've already had that idea on the back here. But yeah, I think that would be the coolest thing ever to make some cinnamon toast crunch Rice Krispie treats, or not cinnamon toast crunch. Uh, well, I mean, maybe some toast crackers. I don't know. That might, that might be next level. Mix them both together. But uh, no, some Rice Krispie treats with that cereal, that cinnamon sugar. Uh, that'd be good. Real good, I think. So all in all, I got a wedding today. Christina's going to finish packing a bunch of stuff up here in the house. We're trying to get out as fast as possible. We're trying to get the heck out of here. Um, but it's a process. It's a process, process, process. We think if worse comes to worse, we're going to get a storage unit pile everything in the storage unit and just keep looking and looking and looking for apartments. Um, talked to our landlord yesterday um, at the club, as you guys know in the video previously, or earlier on in the video. Um, he has an apartment upstairs. He also bought a lot of other property. So we might be able to find something short term now and then maybe, just maybe, we'll be able to get some kind of luck with him because he's been in the fence about, on the fence about wanting to turn into a vacation rental, it sounds like. But he might be willing to help us out. So basically, that'd be insane. Live above this freaking shop. Walk right upstairs to go to uh, um, work. Or go right downstairs to go to work. Go right upstairs to go home. It'd be insane next level. So all in all, though, I'm going to end today's video. I got to get ready. Got a wedding to go to today. Never been to this place before, so it should be a good time. We'll bring you along if I, uh, if I remember to film uh, in tomorrow's video. So like I always say, keep on keeping on. Don't let it bring you down. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace. What's going on right here? <laughs>